Somebody said, what you gonna do about it? Oh, and I picked the dough in. Ooh. Oh, it gets lit. <laughs> Bro, the boyfriend not gonna do nothing, bro. The boyfriend ain't gonna do nothing. This man is not Jesus. This man is not. This man is not anybody that's gonna be able to stop you from going to jail. What's up guys, Christopher Dexter here and I'm back with another amazing video man Now today, we got when dumb Karens try to attack cops man Now this is by Dr. Insanity It was posted 4 months ago and already has 16 million views Dr. Insanity doing his thing uh, I ain't got too much to say about this video though So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started Karens are known for their entitled attitudes and yeah. thinking they're above the law yeah. I want the manager of the airport here but what the happens manager when of the airport bark up the right. wrong tree and try to take on police officers? Get I think we've seen this lady. Get your hands off me! Who else? Hey. Stop it! Stop now you gotta charge for battery on a peace officer. This is the ultimate compilation of all these moments, starting with arguably the most satisfying. In early December 2021, multiple drivers reported a blue car speeding down a New Mexico highway. However, oh, shortly man. after pulling them over, he was shown that this was gonna be one of the most difficult stops of his entire career. Let's see. Gonna stop somebody on the side of the highway. Beaten off. The driver had sped off, making a complete fool of the officer. In fact, wow. it had gone so far that the officer was unable to pursue it, and instead Crazy. radioed in the license plate and vehicle description. He did, however, continue in the same direction as the driver, and miraculously managed to spot the car parked outside a gas station nearby. The things you somehow speed off, only you managed gotta to go. get worse. Be stopping nowhere. Hey man, who just walked in owning that car? Bad oh, and you got snitched on. You can't. <laughs> he was better off just getting the ticket, bro. You try to speed off. You stop somewhere to use the bathroom, and you got to switch on. Was it worth it? No, <laughs> it was not worth it at all. What are you gonna do about Come out of the stall and get out now. Try to say what you gonna do about it? Oh, I kicked the dough in. Ooh. Oh, it gets lit. <laughs> Is lit. Shotty said, I'm peeing. What are you gonna do about it? Hold him, kick that dough in. Come out of the stall and get out. Now. Um, I'm peeing. Get out of the fucking vehicle. Shotty said, Oh my god. Get out here now. Get out. I'm get your out. fucking hands what? up. What about you? I didn't do anything. I'm Shut up. Pee. Shut up. Wasn't you. What? That's why they told me you're driving that blue car, right? Yes. Okay, good. You are now detained. So I figured out exactly why, why you left from. Because you took off my traffic stop. What are you talking about? While she didn't exactly try to hide it. You can't sit over here talking about some, yeah, I was driving the car that just drove off from the freaking traffic stop. You've already been, st you already been pulled out the stall. What's the point in lying here? Why are we lying at this moment? She was the driver of the blue vehicle before officially right. detaining her. And now right. that he's got her cuffed, he's able to get to the bottom of exactly why she sped off and Stop what she could be hiding turn. from the cops. Right. No, you need to get, you, Come on. let me go, let me go. Shut this up. This is an asshole, let me go. So what happens when you run from the police. Let me go. Come on. No, let me go, let me go. Oh, she did not want to go to jail. Stand right here and separate your feet. Separate your feet. Separate your feet! This is just the start of the resistance from this woman, as she continues to beg the officer to release her. But this cop isn't making the same mistake twice. Just think nah, yeah. the abuse from his colleagues if he lets this woman escape again. Yeah, so he for real though. For back, continues to try and identify her. Where's your ID? I don't know. I'm What's your name? Jamie. Jamie what? Ranger. The only place you're going is to jail. Ooh. I didn't do anything. Okay. Okay. I did not do anything. Okay. Please let me go. I just want to call my boyfriend, please. You're not calling What are you going to do? Place. What are you going to do? Go to the, the jail. You're going to go to jail for resisting arrest. Yep. Eluding. Yep. I didn't do anything. Yes, you did. I stopped you 
Eight miles no, down the road. I'm not, I'm I stopped you eight miles down the road. Please. You pulled over for me, and then you took off. No, I did not. Okay, I, I got to go talk please, to the manager really quick. My the woman was nah, identified bro. as nah, Jamie bro. Granger, and the manager confirmed she was indeed the driver of the blue Hyundai. He also apologized Hyundai. for kicking in their now was. broken bathroom door. When he wow. returned to Jamie and his colleague, she still hadn't given her identity over, despite having not stopped screaming since the officer left. So he decided it was time time to try and finally strike a deal and get some information out of her. Please, Let's see. Please. Still no identity. No, that's fine. If you work with me, I'm going to work with you. Let me call okay. my boyfriend, please. If I let you call your boyfriend, you're going to tell me who you are? Where's your phone? Yeah. It's, it's, I think it's in my car right there. Where? Right, right the blue car right behind. Obviously right the blue car, but where in the blue car? And I don't know, in the, in the console, I think. Okay. So I noticed that while we were in the bathroom, that I smelled a faint odor of alcohol coming from you. Have you had anything to drink today? A little bit. Yes. A little bit. Is that why you ran from me? No. Okay. No, I didn't so know the, re you were the reason for the reason why I stopped you, okay, is because you were called in by several people failing to maintain your lane and going head on with their cars. Okay. Oh. Don't don't play games with me right now. Okay. Yep. I'm not stupid. Stop <clears throat> treating me like I am. Okay. When I turned boyfriend. around and put my lights on. Okay. Bro, the when boyfriend not gonna do nothing, bro. The boyfriend ain't gonna do nothing. This man is not Jesus. This man is not. This man is not. Anybody that's gonna be able to stop you from going to jail, <laughs> unless your boyfriend is the best lawyer. Unless your lawyer, I mean, yo, yo, your boyfriend is Judge Mathis. I don't see how you are gonna get out the situation, bro. You need Judge Mathis, Judge Judy. You need every. You need everybody on your side. You need Bill Clinton. That's what you need. Unless your boyfriend is Bill Clinton. Time to put my lights on. I saw you driving the car. When I got out of the truck and walked around, you decided to take off. No, yes. I did not. No, yep. no, did. no, no, I did call not. It? Then what do you I call was just it? coming to the gas station. Negative. I swear, I did not know you were after me. I swear. That's I why you. That's why you pulled that. over for me. That's why I stopped right behind no, you. Okay. I didn't know. It's not even in question She's that Jamie lying. is lying through her teeth here, but at least they have an explanation hey. for everything now. Hey. She hey. What I say in that other video, when them girls be snotty nose crying, all them tears flowing down their face, don't take it seriously, bro. Don't don't take that. <laughs> don't take that stuff seriously, bro. Had more than a little to drink, so they can do now that the officers command. are tasked with figuring out exactly how much. To calm her down, though, they let her call her boyfriend while they finish some paperwork. And what it is he going to do? do the trick. But unfortunately, their moment of peace wouldn't last for so long. How much you had to drink today? Nothing. Yeah, that's not what you told me initially. No. Okay. Nothing. So you had nothing to drink? No. Nope. Okay. So would you be willing to take some standardized field sobriety tests so nope. I can see? No? Sure. Yep, you, you, I'll take some field sobriety tests, sure. So, here's the deal. If you try to run... I'm not going to run. All right. I'm gonna Man, she ain't going nowhere. There's a possibility you might I'm get injured. I'm not going to run. Okay. I did not... No, I'm not going to run. Okay. Unbuckle me. I'll take whatever test you want. You want to take some field sobriety tests? Sure. All right. So we're going to go right over here. We're going to use okay. that, that line. I thought that she was going to attack him. Flat. Okay. We're out of the way. That big yellow line right there on the road. Okay. All right. And if I pass these tests... You're still going to jail. What? <laughs> I already told you. What'd I do? For evading. You evaded. We've all seen these sobriety tests before. She's made to follow the officer's finger to check for strange eye movements, walk the yellow line, and stand on one leg. But before the cop can even start with the second test, Jamie decides she's had enough. But not in the way you might expect. Don't start yet. Okay? I didn't tell you to start. Do you understand my test? You know what? I'm drunk. Okay? I'm drunk. Okay. I just want my boyfriend, okay? Where's your boyfriend at? You called him? I don't know. Okay, well, do you want to finish the test or do you want to stop? Just stop. Okay. No, do not put me back in those. I will, I will gladly. Listen, listen to me. I'll put him in the front if you just chill out. Okay, but I have to put him on you. Okay? Man, these females begin the special treatment. Even when they not getting the special treatment, they begin the special treatment, bro. You think he will be... Over here reasoning with a man if he was if she if he was crying, sitting up there. I don't want to do that. I'm just I'm drunk. No, please just don't. No. You think he would be sitting up there trying to reason with this crying man? Because it's a female and she's all emotional and worked up over something that she did. Over something that she did, she's gonna be able to get the handcuffs in front. <laughs> but y'all swear y'all so oppressed. All right, so you're gonna be under arrest 
for driving under the influence of intoxicating liquor and or drugs. Okay. <laughs> There's something I need to read to you. All right. Miranda writes. <laughs> The cop reads her her rights and heads off to do a little more paperwork while she once again calls her boyfriend. The cop is being is extremely respectful and understanding to a woman that, frankly, doesn't deserve it at all. And what does he get in return? Well, you're about to find out. Let's okay, see. Jamie. So, but he hung up on you? He's gonna come get me. Oh, he's well, not. We're going to so jail. So we're talk about that, okay? What? You want to hold on to your phone? That way you can use it again? All right. So... With these charges that you're receiving, there is no bond, which means you cannot get out of jail. I did not do anything. Well, that's the difference of opinion we have. What? Okay. What? So <laughs> that's the difference of a piss. You're, well, you're driving drunk opinion. because you're under arrest for driving under the influence. Okay. You took off from my traffic stop, which is resisting and evading. So you're going to go to jail for that. Okay. Stop, well, I can't help you if you don't remember, but I definitely remember you. Okay? Yeah. No. Please no. That's not how this works. Her. Okay. That's not how no. this works. What am I supposed to do? Sit in jail. Go to jail. All right. No. Yeah. I can't yeah. Sit in part, jail. Part yeah, you can. To, part of the process of towing your car. Man, you bro, you gotta be able to take the lick, bro. I don't. Ugh, man. Y'all gotta be able to take the lick. I gotta be able to take it, or else don't do it. What did you think? You actually thought that if you called your boyfriend, that'll be a get out of jail free car. You thought that your boyfriend was gonna come through like Superman. It comes swoop and save the day. I'm, just, I'm, I, she gotta be dating Bill Clinton or Barack Obama, just something. So that's uh, what Donald Trump. She, you look like somebody that Donald Trump would take. Now, are there any large quantities of money that I need to be made aware of that no. way? Okay. Do you have any no. firearms in there? No. Okay. I have to ask those questions. All right. It seems that something about the officer searching her car set her off. But just seconds after the cop discovers two open bottles of vodka by the oh, driver's man. seat, she goes ballistic. Let me okay. What? Tell you what. Let me go. I'm gonna put the handcuffs behind your back if you don't stop. No, let me go. No. I did not do this. Let me go. You Who did it? Hold my car. He about to up the window on us. Okay. No, you're not getting out. Yes, I am. No, no, no. Get off me. Get off me. Get off me. Stop it. What's wrong you're with gonna this get a You're gonna Stop get a Stop it! Sexual gonna, assault! You're gonna get an additional Sexual assault! You're gonna get an Let me go! Do you, let me go! You're gonna get bad Sexual gonna, assault! You're gonna get another charge no, if you hit me. Let me go! She let just hit you. Go. Come back over here, put no. your seatbelt on. No! Come back let over me here. go! Come on. No! Come on. Okay. Let me go! The kick to the officer's chest disconnected his body cam for a moment. But when it returns, she's outside of the vehicle still crying, but with an extra charge of battery on an officer. Yo, who is who is her boyfriend? <laughs> I really be feeling like people be dating certain people just because they got no other options. Like there's gotta be somebody. Like like how like how did he go through all the fish in the sea? He saw this fish. He was like, that's my fish. That's This is the fish that's right for me. What made him think that? It got to be drugs. Got to be drugs. Because there's no way. Most worse than the resisting, biting, and kicking is the false claims of sexual assaults at the officer. When horrible people like Jamie make these bogus allegations, it belittles women who are actually victims of it. And can be result in that. actual claims being discredited in future cases. But that seems to be the least of Jamie's worries. She's more concerned with making as big a scene as possible. In the delusional hope that it'll somehow get her released. Let me go! Let me go! So she getting get in there. Get in. Get in. No, no, get in. No, get in. Get in. Get in. Get your feet in. Get your feet in. Yo, yo, yo. She is going crazy right now, bro. Like, for real, bro, these people really don't be realizing that they're getting recorded. These videos are getting posted to YouTube, bro. And they showed your name in your face. So, and how many views did this video get? 
16 million, bro. 16 million people just saw this woman with her full name in her face act like this, bro. You can't never show your face again, bro. You can't never. You got to walk around with the Pooh Shiesty mask on, bro. Now, these are the people that got to rock that. Got to rock that thing everywhere, bro. Because no one can see your face after this, bro. Anybody, your family, <laughs> your family got to live through this, bro. Your family gotta 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 sit back and watch this video and be like, yo. That's Auntie, that's Auntie, whatever her name is. Like, <laughs> she always did make the worst macaroni and cheese. <laughs> I guess this is why <laughs> that lady was going through it. <laughs> she always did make the worst macaroni and cheese, but it was watery. It was <laughs> Let me go! Get in. No! Let me go! Let me go! Come on. No! Put no! your foot in. No! Can you no! go around the other side? We'll drag her in. Let me go! Let me go! Put your foot in there. No! Come on. <sighs> you'll get another. You'll get another charge. No! Get in. No! Get in. No! Get in. Put your foot Shut in. Shut up! Hurry me! Get in. Just pull her off. She is insane. It was never this hard. It was never this hard. Thank you. Leave her. Hi. Ooh, got her in there. Got her in there, people, dude. Oh, yeah. Unfortunately hey. for this poor officer, he had to spend many more hours with Jamie while he took her to jail and booked her. But we are able to skip straight to the charges. In court, she pleaded guilty to aggravated DWI and two counts of battery on a police officer. But yep. unfortunately, her exact charges are unknown. But if you thought that was bad, wait until you see this next Karen. What's up, lady? Oh, 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 oh. These two cops were called to an apartment building for a noise complaint, but noise things complaint. escalated quickly. You need to get away from the house. Oh, right, here we go. Mm -hmm. hey, you? Yeah, I don't like you either, so as long as we're clear. I am a, a nurse, and I did 12 You're years of it, yeah. and you need to get off and I told you this no, is a no, no. lot building get outside of my building now the woman is clearly who do you intoxicated think you are? are you the landlord are you the landlord I'm talking about some get out of my building now first of all she's clearly drunk second of all who done who are you feeling like <laughs> these are them people that like they like she probably won prom queen and like she just never got off the hype of it. <laughs> Unaware of what's going on. Remember, she's the one that called the cops to her building, but it seems she's completely forgotten exactly why she did that and is now taking offense to the police's presence in her building. So she You're called the cops. No, I'm not lieutenant. So get down. Who are you? I said get down. You think you're the chief? That would be great. Oh, that will never happen. Who called? You were drunk. I'm telling you to get called? out of my building. Well, what's going on? Because I'm set. I need to go to the hospital. Okay. What's wrong? The hospital? Why is this happening? Why? 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 Where are you? <laughs> yo, yo, yo. I need to go to the hospital. Okay. What's wrong? And why? Why is this happening? Why? 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 Where are you speaking? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I gotta do it again. I gotta do it again. Why? 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 The cops are clearly lady. not phased by the woman whatsoever and are just there to do their jobs. They were called by the woman and want to get to the bottom of why. If right. they can determine that it was done maliciously with <coughs> good reason, they can charge her for wasting police resources. Yep. But the way things are going, she's about to catch a disorderly conduct case as well. You yep. don't ever come around my door. How about this? Here. Don't call us and I won't come back here. 
I know how to be this far. What does that mean? I have me this far. Please do it. Like you got fired? I was a nurse for over many, many years. years. I don't care. Exactly. <laughs> I don't care. I think it's all the Yeah, yeah. Come on, let's go. And you don't ever walk over there. You could have just easily stayed in the house. What in the world is wrong with this lady? You could have stayed and they was literally about to walk off and walk away. Why are you coming outside? Inside. You gotta walk up my stairs again. I'm gonna treat you like a four year old and start counting if you don't go in there. I have a lot building. Rock me out. You. She thinks she's somebody, mama. Lock building. I'm telling you, right, don't ever, you do not ever come in my building. Shut again. up. The officers know <laughs> the woman is just extremely drunk and confused, and staying on her property is just making things worse. So yeah. they decide to just leave and hope she manages to settle down. But before they. This is a man, he would have got tackled and taken out, bro. <laughs> they see her leave her apartment and start attacking one of her tenants. <laughs> How is she slinging on somebody? I'm going to jail. Yeah. Yeah, you're going to jail. We give you a lot of I'm sorry. I'm sorry. After her arrest, yeah. the woman was taken to the police station for further processing, where she continues to be loud, angry, and awkward as ever. What's in my name? It's my name is Ann Stinson. Call my family. Look at the camera. No, take my... No! I said no, no. Ann Stinson, you gotta you chill. Gonna to no. Miss Stinson. Okay, listen, listen. He did wrong. Are you listening? I didn't do anything wrong. He did this. He Would did... You like to have no! No! It took a while, but the woman was eventually processed and charged with disorderly conduct. She was allowed to sleep off the alcohol in jail and sent back on her way. But somehow, this woman doesn't even come close to the level of anger and violence that the girl in our next case does. Get oh Lord. Get on February 25th, 2022, cops received a call about a possible drunk driver outside a bar. When Let's they arrived, it. they found something they never expected. The driver sleeping? of the vehicle was asleep with the engine on and his foot on the gas pedal. Had the car he not been in park, he'd have been speeding straight ahead into traffic. So the cops knew they were going to have to wake the driver up and figure out what's going on. Take your foot off the gas. Wow. Would you go ahead and step out of the vehicle for me, all right? Oh yeah, you know he was drinking. Tired, dude. You passed out with your foot on the pedal. The gas, the accelerator. Do you realize what could have happened here? Right? Smoked any weed today? Yes, sir. Yeah. Uh, earlier, this is being honest. Yeah, when was the last time? Earlier. Uh, it uh, smells like it in the car. The man admits to have so been you know drinking have and to smoking tonight, and judging by his slurred speech and condition when they found him, it's clear he was definitely too impaired to be driving. So yeah. he decides to skip the sobriety tests and gets put straight in cuffs. Yeah. I'm sorry. Imagine that was bad. That was that was, shouldn't have happened. You understand, sir? If you weren't in park, your car would have been going across the street into traffic. 100%. You're probably not going to do. I can't make that promise that you could find a ride. <laughs> oh my God. The two-year-old just comes out of everybody, bro. It just cause you promise I'm not going to jail. I would have said, I promise, buddy. I promise you're not going to jail. Just so we can keep them calm. Because y'all know, like, you got to lie to them little kids, bro. You got to lie to them little kids. Please call my mom. Hold on one second, sir. in there, dude. I'm so sorry. Two year old just comes now, out this of should be where man. the story ends, but it turns out the man's girlfriend was still inside the bar, and when she saw the cops searching her car, she was not happy whatsoever. Oh my god, what the f going on? That's my f car. Oh, 
Okay. Well, here, I'll... What the f are you doing? You need to calm, calm down. down. No, calm you down. need to get the down. in my car. Calm you down. down. For what? Then talk... To cut and record this right now. What the f for what? Who, to cut and record this right now. I did literally nothing wrong. No. Who is this lady? What's wrong with her? What the f Why are they even searching my car? Because your boyfriend went and crashed out in the car. He was in the driver's seat. For what? Drunk driving. It's obvious his girlfriend... She don't know what's going on. She just tight. She just tight. She just don't want nobody all up in her car, bro. She don't know what is happening. She just mad. She ready to go off on anybody. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> she ready to go off on anybody. The man sitting there like, yo, your boyfriend was literally passed out in the driver's seat with his foot on the gas pedal, drunk driving. She don't even know. She's just going off. She just go on ballistic. Exactly sober either. And the more the cops try to calm her down, the angrier she seems to get. Yeah, and what she's are drunk. What are you talking about? Why are you in my f***ing car? Because he was in the car, his operating car, and he's out on the rest of the How? How? Where's the f***ing, where's the security footage? What do you mean, how? <laughs> you need to be asking him that. How did he get in your car? <laughs> what do you mean, how? Ask him. He admitted to it. Ask him. Talk about some where's the security for this. Shut up. <laughs> she she just up. Oh, this girl about to get on my nerves. Run it. Are you about some run it. shit me right now? You no. searched my, that's my f***ing car. And? You didn't have my f***ing permission. You, are you we didn't know that was your car. My marijuana? Yeah. There, that's, there's you marijuana. arrested him. Yeah, there's marijuana. Oh, now I mean, what? Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> First of all, you was just sitting over here. That's my car. That's my car. That's my car. That's my car. And then now when we bring up the <laughs> now when we bring up the marijuana, marijuana, you arrested him. Take it because it's decriminalized in the state of Ohio. It is decriminalized in the state of Ohio. That's my mother. SUV. You don't have my permission to search any goddamn car. I don't need your permission. Go ahead. Search the car and no, you're, you're not going to search my mother you need car. You to raise your voice or you're going to be placed on For the what? Car for what? Your car. investigation for what? That's my car. You do not have my... Get a search warrant. That is my f car. You do search not have my permission. Search warrant. The cops obviously are correct here, and they are allowed to search the vehicle. As the man admitted to smoking marijuana and the cops smelled it inside the vehicle, they have yep. reasonable suspicion to believe that either the man or the owner of the vehicle were breaking the law. Yep. This gives them the authority to search the vehicle and confiscate the drugs without a search warrant. Yep. However, the girl just doesn't seem to understand this and continues shouting and arguing with the cops for a further three minutes before they decide to put her under arrest. But they could never expect what she would do next. I literally don't have none on me. Okay. I literally don't have none on me. It doesn't matter. Nothing, you're, literally you're nothing safety, is on you're me. Not walking behind nothing you. is on okay. me right now. I want to walk behind you because you're not going to flick shit on my goddamn boyfriend. He's a felon. Put your hands behind your back. Now you know, put. Oh my go. god. Now he a felon. You talking so much. We didn't even know he was a felon yet. Well, he probably did because they ran his ID. But at the same time, like you just like you making yourself look so 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 bad. Honey, baby, we're gonna okay. sue the state of Claremont County. But tonight you won't be. I'm not just the rest. Stop. I literally did nothing. You have no. Put your hand behind your back. Put your hand behind your back, man. Get the stop. Get off right now. Oh, so I need five men. Everybody's close. Get the. I need one mother. Yeah, one mother. Go ahead. Go ahead. This lady is insane. I got, I got her. Yo, this is a man. He would have got tased, bro. If this was a man, a black man, he would have got tased. Mexican man, any type, of, any, any man, he would have got tased, bro. He would have got tased, bro. These ladies be so privileged and they know it that's the only reason why she acting like this you think they was gonna let a whole man kick him in the head he would have got tased so quick he, he might even got shot <laughs> he might even got shot you know what i'm saying like this is ridiculous bro these women know for a fact that they can do this type of stuff and kind of get away with it a little bit they know for a fact. That's why they so quick to disrespect. 
They're so quick to hit. They're so quick to kick. They're so quick to... Because they know that they're going to get let off because they women. they girls. they they emotional. You know, you, you got to handle them with kitten gloves. They know that they get some type of special treatment just off the simple fact that they are females. So they take it and they do the most extreme stuff, bruh. It's ridiculous. Get the f*** if you kick again, you're gonna get hobbled. Right? Kick again? Are you are get in the car. Work your mark. Get in the car. Work your get in the car. Put the seatbelt on. Thank you, please. Safety is very important. After aggressively oh, resisting the officers and even kicking one of them in the head, she yeah, is she finally really placed in the back of a patrol vehicle and taken to the station. In search of the vehicle, multiple pill bottles and large bags of marijuana were also recovered. So the girl was, was hit with dirty, charges dirty. of obstructing official business, resisting arrest, and disorderly conduct. Yep. It's unclear what the man's charges were, but he was allowed to return to his apartment after the events of that night. Wow, so the dude that was actually like that the the dude that was actually in trouble at first gets to go home and chill. But you, since you wanna act so crazy, y'all y'all see the difference. That's the clear difference. You go out there acting crazy with the police, talking to them crazy. Kicking them, resisting them, act, doing the extras, you're going to go to jail. But if the police walk up on you and you just calmly, just feel me, everything going to go smooth. You might even be able to go home. You might even be able to go home. You feel me? Y'all got to understand, bro. <laughs> There's only one way to live this life successfully, bro. There's only one way. There's only one way. But none of these Karens were quite as entitled and insane as this one. I want the manager this is the last the one. Here. Yeah. I don't want it now. On the 25th now. of May 2021, police were called to a public disturbance at an airport. They had no idea what to expect, but they didn't think it'd be this bad. A I did nothing. Ma'am, what happened? Chokehold it? You mean he put you in a chokehold? He did not chokeholded you. <laughs> she didn't. You did not get chokeholded. You got put in a chokehold. <laughs> no, you need to talk to him. He chokeholded me. They saw it. My God, what is wrong with America? Calm down. Calm down. Relax, no, bro. That guy needs to be arrested. On, Calm down. Calm down, bro. Calm down. Ma'am, what's your name? I'm off. She is insane. He threw me to the ground. What's your name? My name is Terry M. Blues. Come over here and we'll talk, okay? As you'd expect, none of the other passengers saw anyone chokehold Terry, but they did see her drunkenly rush to her gate and push past other passengers to get to the front of the queue. Okay. A passenger stopped her from pushing past and forced her back in line. This caused her to start yelling and claiming that she was assaulted. As you can tell from this next clip, her actions didn't make her very popular with the other passengers. Yeah. Let's go over here, ma'am. I'm a woman! Over here. Bruh, what's she about to say? What's she about to say? He me to the ground! Ma'am, let's go over here, ma'am. I'm a woman! Over here. In a dress! Ma'am. I'm a woman in a dress. Over here. Over here. In a dress. Ma'am. I'm a woman in a dress. I ain't gonna lie. I'd have probably... <laughs> I'd have probably turned up on it. Like, you coming out here with all that... <laughs> I was like, hey, shut up. <laughs> like, you feel me, bro? Like, people coming to this airport to go to on a business trip. People trying to go on vacation. People moving from place to place. Don't got, they already stressed out. They got stuff to deal with. You feel me? Somebody probably just, probably going to a funeral. And here you come with the... Let's go over here. Man, let's go over here, okay? You so I said boohoo. I want the manager of the airport here. Now. Ma'am. No. 
Calm down. I want the manager here. Okay, we'll get the manager. I'm not gonna be treated like this. Ma'am. Ma treated like what? Here. I am an officer. I am an officer. Oh. I've been through hell trying to get through this goddamn airport service. Bro, bro. I want some help. I okay. Don't want it. Okay. Jerry continues okay. to scream and plead for one it. of the other passengers to stand up for her and say they saw the attack, but to no avail. She spends the next five minutes repeating the same story and doesn't stop screaming at any point. So the cop decides instead to go and talk to the man that she's claiming attacked her. Yeah. But the interaction didn't go the way the cop expected. Let's see. No, no, bring her him out. No, no, no. She was making a ruckus over there in front of the bank. She came up behind us to get in the boarding line. Mm -hmm. And it wasn't her group, I got. She tried to bust through. Yeah. She came over and shut the door to us. The one door was halfway shut and she came rushing through the door. She said that you grabbed her neck. Sorry. I pushed her. So you have an idea or anything? Absolutely. The man hey, but that's why you can't even be touching these girls, bro. You can't even be touching these women, bro. I, I literally be going out my way to make sure that my elbows don't even brush past no girl. I ain't even gonna lie. And it's not because I'm scared to touch women or whatever. But, bro, these females can literally make up a lie and say anything. These females can make up a lie and say anything. And if enough people believe it, it's game over. It doesn't matter what you did. It doesn't matter how it happened. If she says something and enough people believe it, you did it. If she says something and enough people are able to vouch for what she's saying, even if they all in cahoots and they all just making like one big lie, they all working together, make one big lie. And even if they get found out, even if people find out that they was lying, guess what? It still doesn't matter. Your reputation's already still ruined. It, it could be. Years after people find out that you was lied on, and people will still be sitting there trying to make up other rumors. Oh, maybe he coerced her. Maybe this. Maybe that. You know, maybe he really did do something like that. So that's why you gotta. It's chess, not checkers, bro. You know what I'm saying? Maybe you shouldn't have pushed her, but maybe you should have went and told somebody, "Hey, yo, she. This what she doing. She could have got dealt with accordingly." But putting your hands on her. That's, do you see how easy she it was able for it was she was able to make up a lie, and if she had a crowd of people that thought like her, then hey, you probably would have been the one getting kicked off the airplane. You probably would have been the one in trouble, even though you ain't do nothing wrong. It's crazy. The story politely stayed calm and complied with the officer. A direct contrast to how Terry is still acting. Terry, calm down and breathe. No! Let's go have a seat. No! Terry. Why not? He's choke holding me. Look at the cameras. Okay. He threw me to the ground and choke holding me. Okay. Another passenger. Uh -huh. Do you know what he Because that on? woman at the reservation just sent him on me. You want to come have a seat so I can help you out? Please help me. I'm here to help you, okay? Let's get you sit down so you can catch your breath. You want some water? You want to go to yeah, the water? Yeah, she needs some water. She needs some water. That's the water fountain over here, okay? Do you want to get some water? Sure. Yeah, everybody, thank you for sticking up for me. Okay. No one's she's stuck up for you. But she's slowly calming down. Good. However, she's still lashing out at the passengers for not immediately rushing to her aid. Thank you for helping me. Shut up. Okay. Here, get some water. Yeah, don't care about my shit. I don't care. I just want to go home. Go home, please. Oh go God, home. I'm never flying again. I can't stand America. That's I'm a, that's to great. Spain. Please do. Please, later? please go to Spain. Yes, I did. It's not against the law. No, it's not. How much did you have a drink today? I had a couple of margaritas. A couple of margaritas. You can go talk to the bartender. Okay. I had a Yo, they should make it against the law to be able to drink and fly. <laughs> hey, listen, you can't drink and drive. Why should you be able to drink and get on a plane where you clearly messed up in the head 
And you over here acting belligerent. You over here acting crazy, throwing a whole temper tantrum over the smallest little things. They should make it illegal to be able to drink and come to the airport and do this. <laughs> this should be illegal, bro. This shouldn't be able to be happening. That's my that's my suggestion. They should make it illegal to drink and fly. <laughs> Find time with those people until I got here. Terry is right. It's not illegal to have a few drinks, but it's almost certainly contributing to her outburst. Right. At this point, it's been almost 15 minutes, and she's still yet to calm down. In fact, she seems to only be getting worse. You go talk to him. Sure. Tell that guy truck holding me. Sure. No, you haven't even got him off the plane to talk to him. Sure. No! Relax. You need to investigate. Relax. I, Terry, relax. I'm a retired officer. Okay. I don't know. I don't have to. Who are you a police officer with? <laughs> I don't have to what? <laughs> I don't have to what? What are you, what are you, what are you resisting? I'm confused on what she thinks is going on. I don't know what she thinks is happening. Is that good enough? No, that's, that's good. Thank you for your service, Terry. No, I don't need to explain why that guy chokeholding me when we he's We didn't ask you. We didn't ask you to explain. Nobody stood up for me. Nobody Terry. fucking took a report or nothing. Terry, calm down. It's all We're not enough. officers. Everybody saw it. Terry. Nobody would stand up and said this girl was chokeholded by a passenger. Terry. Shame on Oh my god. I don't give a fuck. That's why America is fucking going to the dogs. Okay. Nobody will stand up for anyone. Yeah. You fucking piece of shit. Yeah. I'm not. No. Man, I ain't gonna lie. She should have been arrested. She should have been pants behind her. Like, because she's not about to calm down. I don't know why they thought she was going to calm down. They just sitting over here. Terry, 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 Terry. Terry. Just get her off the, get her off, get her out of here, bro. Don't nobody want to hear all this. Don't nobody feel like listening to all this, all the hoop. You feel me? <coughs> Only thing that can make sense is if they were sitting over there waiting on backup to post so that they can, you know, get her off, get her out of there easily. But y'all over here dealing with her little temper tantrum because she's going to calm down at any point. She's clearly not. She only getting worse. Like, she should have been arrested. Being arrested for being chokehold. Please, worry. someone film this. Please. You want to lock it? I God got... damn it! Please, someone. All of the attempts what do you to think calm is what down the... failed, you know what I mean? so the cops were left with no choice but to put her in cuffs and yep. take her away. But even yep. this didn't stop her from screaming and being violent against the officers. Stop! And if you calm down, it won't hurt anymore. Oh, you fucking asshole! Put my legs down! Put my legs down! Kicking me. Please! Somebody film this! Terry. God damn it, leave me alone! I fucking two faced! Get away from me! She told me she would help me. She's a fucking two faced! I just got you kicking, I was my, kicking my partner on camera, so. Yeah. I don't care! I've never been in jail in my life! Terry, well, you're, about to, out of the <laughs> you're about to have an amazing first experience. You're about to, <laughs> you're about to have an amazing walkthrough, an amazing tour of the of the prison system. Talking about something I've never been in jail in my life. All right, well, it's time to get acquainted. <laughs> it's time, it's time to get acquainted, bro. It's time to, it's time to meet your new best friend. Cause yeah. <laughs> and cops attempted to put her in the back of the patrol vehicle but who would have guessed this just made her more violent yep. i told you to talk to the bartender Please what help bartender me! Help me! let go of the cuffs we're not taking the cuffs off i'm not fucking doing anything unless you let go Man, of these you fuck Man. you break my arm i'm not trying to break your arm but you are, you are state of no i'm not no. i'm a mother don't do this to me Step up, man. I always, I always think of that, the whole mother thing. Like, shouldn't that be a reason for you to calm down? Shouldn't that be a reason for you to act right? Ma'am, ma'am, ma step stop. up. No. Step in the vehicle. You fucking asshole. Let me alone. Let me alone. How y'all let? let how y'all? They're fucking breaking my arms. God damn you! You, you motherfuckers. Me. I'll go quietly. You take these fucking goddamn cuffs off of me. Taking the cuffs. No! After she would have got a nice good right hook. She's pissing me off. I would have just real quick.
Shut up. She continued to scream for the entire ride back to the jail. After the presumably long journey for the cops, Terry was charged with public intoxication, resisting arrest, possession of marijuana, and possession of a dangerous drug. It seems that alcohol fueled rage and. Yeah, man. So, uh, new rules. Don't drink in park. <laughs> Don't be drinking while you're in park. Don't be drinking while you're driving. And don't be drinking while you're flying. As a matter of fact, just don't drink. Right? Can, can, can we just not not drink? Maybe that'll be the, 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 the problem solver. Can't we, can't we start looking for problem solvers now? Like when, did, when, when, when is it going to be too late for us to start looking for problem solvers? You know? But anyway, man, if you guys like this video, if it's pretty cool, if you leave a like, comment, and subscribe, turn on the post notifications, share them videos with all of your friends, and a ton of some guys. Peace out. And I just had to clear my mind real quick. They count me out, but I be all the odds and all them differences. You said a white man, you don't get no perks, you don't get no benefits. You serve yourself, you get what you deserve. I swear I witnessed it. I got it together. Me and my brother, we sticking together.